The Lockheed Martin's F-35 multirole fighter, also known as the Lightning II, was a contender for the Joint Strike Fighter JSF, program, which was intended to replace existing aircraft types with a common fighter. The JSF concept was introduced by the U.S. Air Force. Aim of this program was to combine conventional fighter aircraft for the Air Force, catapulted shipborne aircraft for the U.S. Navy and short takeoff and vertical landing fighter for the U.S. Marine Corps. The Lockheed Martin's proposed aircraft was previously known as the X-35 and had won competition against the Boeing X-32. From 1997 its development has been shared with Northrop Grumman and BAE Systems. The first X-35 a prototype was rolled out in 2000 and made its maiden during the same year. Development of this aircraft was principally funded by the USA, with the UK and other partner governments providing additional funding. However development of this fighter was plagued by constant cost overruns. In 2015 a short takeoff and vertical landing version of the F-35, the F-35B, reached initial operational capability with the US Marine Corps. During the same year, full-rate production of the F-35 commenced. A conventional takeoff and landing version, the F-35A, entered service with the U.S. Air Force in 2016. A carrier-based F-35C version reached initial operational capability with the U.S. Navy in 2019. The U.S. military planned to obtain over 2,440 of these aircraft of all types. These will replace the AV-8B, A-10, S-16 and F-A-18 warplanes. However, due to cost overruns, it is likely that fewer new aircraft will be obtained. In 2015, the first F-35 aircraft was delivered to the Italian Air Force. It was the first production aircraft delivered outside the United States. Countries that ordered the F-35 include Australia, Canada, Denmark, Israel, Italy, Netherlands, Norway, Saudi Arabia, Singapore, South Korea, Turkey, United Kingdom, and possibly some other. However, some operators ordered relatively small number of these multi-role fighters due to its impressive price tag. In 2020, Lockheed Martin delivered its 500th F-35 fighter. In 2022, Northrop Grumman delivered 900th center fuselage for the F-35. The generic F-35 has a configuration similar to that of Lockheed Martin's own F-22 design, however it is slightly smaller and has one engine. Aircraft with a single engine is less expensive to produce and to service, but at a cost of reduced weapon load and performance. The F-35 exploits stealth technology, which reduces its radar cross-section and makes it harder to detect for radars. It has a radar cross-section of 0.005 M. Currently it is one of the most advanced fighter aircraft in the world. Only the F-22 Raptor is more capable. Also the F-35 is the second true fifth-generation fighter after the F-22. Latest Chinese and Russian fighters such as Chengdu J-20 or Sukhoi Su-57 cannot match the F-35 in terms of technology. Two different afterburning turbofan engines were developed for this multi-role fighter. The Pratt & Whitney F-135 was developed from F-119 engine used on the F-22 Raptor. It competed against an advanced General Electric slash Rolls-Royce F-136 engine. Eventually, the Pratt & Whitney engine was selected. So far it is the most powerful fighter engine ever developed. There are two different variants of this engine, including conventional variant for F-35A and F-35C fighters and a modified multicycle engine for F-35B short takeoff and vertical landing, style, fighter. Interestingly Rolls-Royce company developed vertical lift systems for both Pratt & Whitney and General Electric designs. The Lightning II is capable of cruising at supersonic speeds. The F-35 multi-role fighter can perform on air defense missions, close air support and tactical bombing. It can carry up to two air-to-air -air missiles or two air-to-ground weapons in its internal weapon bay. The F-35 fighter is compatible with AIM-120 AMROM, AIM-132 OSROM, JDAM, JSOW, Brimstone, WCMD, and BDA Meteor, and some other missiles. Additional missiles, bombs or fuel tanks can be attached to external hardpoint. Wingtip pylons can also carry AIM-9X Sidewinder short-range air-to-air missiles. However, external weapons are carried at the expense of being more detectable by radars. Only one version of the F-35, the F-35A has got an internally mounted 4-barrel 25mm cannon and 182 rounds of onboard ammunition. 
The F-35B and C versions can carry an external pod with the same cannon and 220 rounds of ammunition. This external pod has stealth features. The F-35 is stuffed with the most advanced systems. Its key systems include a multifunction active electrically scanned array, ASA, that combines radar, electronic warfare and communications functions and a conformal array imaging infrared sensor. Data from the various sensors is fused on the pilot's advanced helmet-mounted display system. This multi-role fighter has an in-flight refueling capability. Aircraft is proposed in three main variants, including the F-35A, B and C. Initially it was planned that these variants will share around 80% of their parts to keep development and production costs low. This also would require less logistic support. However it turned out that by 2017 the design commonality was only 20%. So basically there is little use of this commonality. As it eventually turned out the US would rather adopt three different types of aircraft for various branches of the US military instead of this generic aircraft. Development program of the F-35 was plagued by constant cost overruns. Low-rate initial production aircraft had a unit price of around $94 million to $122 million per aircraft, depending on the version. It was planned that a full-rate production F-35A aircraft will cost around $80 to $85 million. As example, the F-22 Raptor Stealthy Fighter costs around $150 million per aircraft. However in 2020 an export sale of 50 F-35 fighters was announced to Saudi Arabia with an estimated value of $10.4 billion. This makes $208 million per aircraft. Though this price might also include training and servicing costs. A helmet of the F-35 alone is said to cost $400,000 and each helmet is tailored to fit to only a single pilot's head as it will be designed to have a heads-up display with the pilot's eyes. The initial contract was supposed to cost $1.5 trillion since its inception in 1996 over 50 years. The current contract is 7 years behind schedule and $163 billion over budget.